Autonomous. Hey everyone, this is Lee Petty from Double Fine. I was a project lead on Autonomous, which we made in two weeks as part of Amnesia Fortnite. And I got uh, Brad Muir. Hey! And Jeff Solis. Hello. Here with me, who were uh, on the team as well. And they're gonna tell you guys some tips and tricks for playing Autonomous. Yeah, so when you spawn in the world, you're gonna have enough parts to build one of these mining robots to be trapped in this room. So uh, Jeff's at the controls, so what are you doing here, Jeff? Uh, well, I'm constructing the basic bot, and I'm gonna fiddle with his brain to get him to do what I want him to do. Okay, so the bot inputs, there's a bunch of different things that you can program inside their heads. So this particular Energon 47 head, it's uh, built to be a mining bot, so it'll always go after the energy cores, and we'll talk about those in a minute. But uh, what kind of settings did you just put on it? I made it so he responds to damage, so he'll defend himself, but if he sees movement, he tries to flee from it. Cool. Uh, and when you're actually building one of these bots, and you know, before you turn it on, you can decide to just yank out the torso if you just want to start, start again. You see, you just aim at it and just pull it out, all the parts fall down, and then you can start over. And the construction always starts with the torso, that's how you sort of enter into this mode. And then when you're ready to activate it like this, what are you doing here? I'm just messing around with the energy settings. Uh, the more you increase energy to one part, the more effective it is. So more energy to the torso gives it more hit points, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And uh, I think for this guy, I'm gonna get choose his, give him a little more energy in his arms to make him mind faster. Sure, sure. So now, uh, after about five seconds, there's a countdown. Uh, the bot will turn on, uh, but you're still locked in this room. So this is we call this a security field, and you can just easily drain those, uh, open it up so the bots can move around, uh, and that will that will add to your energy total, which is the the resource that you use to create uh, create the robots in the world. It looks like he saw a robo-pawn outside and ran from it moving around. Right, so that was just from the fact that you set it to flee from movement, and then uh, its vision cone turned purple and it ran away. And then you can always like uh, deconstruct your bots and, and tweak their behavior if they're not doing what you want them to do. So here, uh, your Energon 47 has found this fusion core in the world, and he's starting to mine it with that mining arm, the E-siphon. <laughs> and you can see the uh, you can see the energy falling out of the fusion core around it, and then you'll be able to pick that up, convert it, gives you more resources in the game. And again, you'll see right there. Yeah. He saw that he saw that robo pawn walking <laughs> around, running away from the armless robo pawn, which is great. <laughs>